Hey everyone, it's Jessica, and today I'm gonna be reviewing and swatching the e.l.f. Matte Lip Colors. Now these are $3 on e.l.f.'s website. I'm gonna be showing you swatches of nine of the shades that they have, they have a lot. I will have all the shades listed below in the order I show you them, but I will also have a link so if you wanna check out the other shades they have that maybe I don't own, I can link that as well. Thank you to Elf for sending me these over the years for PR purposes. I swear I've like slowly been collecting these and I've bought some of them myself too, but I love these so much. They're so cheap. So let's go ahead and get into the swatches and afterwards we'll talk about the pros and cons of whether or not I would recommend these to you guys. about these are well I've got a lot of things I love about them they're so cheap three dollars but not only that they work as both a lip liner and a lipstick they're so opaque they're so creamy in a way that they're creamy so that they glide onto your lips easily but they're not so creamy that they're sliding outside your lip line the one downside to a lipstick is that you have to for me at least if it's a darker color like the one I'm wearing now I would have to not only bring the lipstick to touch up, but I'd want to bring the lip liner that I'm wearing with it. So now suddenly you're bringing two, whereas with these, you just have the one and it works for both and it never crawls outside my lip line. It's crazy. Now, a lot of people talk about how these are a little bit drier of a formula, whereas like there's the Maybelline matte lipsticks that are just a little bit creamier and I do love those too, but they're almost like different products because if I'm looking for something that I'm going to put on and have on for a few hours without being able to look in the mirror to check to see if it needs touched up. I pick these. I pick one of these to wear all the time to work as a teacher and just all the time on the weekends, like if we're going to dinner. This morning I went to breakfast and I wore praline, which is this beautiful kind of fall type color, but I knew that I could drink coffee and while a little bit would get on like the mug, I knew that I wouldn't need to touch it up. It kind of stains your lips in a way and it just stays put. I love these. So let's talk about the packaging. It's really, really sleek and they all look the same, but it's got the color swatch here on the end and the name on the end as well. And then when you open it, it's kind of like a pencil-like bullet. And what is nice, now I've never really used it, but they have this sharpener on the end. And by sharpener, I, it should be called a shaper because you can put it in the end and kind of twist it through it and it reshapes it into more of a pencil-like shape so i think that's nice ha to have as an option if you want it to stay pointed you know especially if you're kind of going around the lines of your lips you want it to be pointed so you can be more precise there's not really a noticeable smell to these at all in fact i don't know if i've ever noticed a smell no there's not they have a huge shade range which i think is fantastic and it's just nice if you're trying to build up your collection and you want to maybe branch out to get more of like a berry color, this is a great one to get because if I'm wearing a really deep or vibrant one of the two colors, I want to know that it's not going to move because I'm already maybe a little self-conscious about wearing it out, but I also don't want to be self-conscious about it, me looking like a clown and having like it coming out the corners or, you know, all those things that could go wrong. I want to be able to trust that it's staying put and these I would trust with that. In fact, I mentioned these as a recommendation in my drugstore wedding makeup video that I talked about the makeup I wore for my wedding. These are fantastic and I would absolutely recommend these for anything where you need it to be long wearing. Maybe special events like a wedding, but also prom or um, a dance, you know, whatever it might be, these would be great. So I think you know that I would recommend these, but hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe. I can link my e.l.f playlist where I've got all kinds of e.l.f. reviews of tons of their products. Some of them are hits, some of them are misses. So if you're interested, check it out. Subscribe if you would, and I'll catch you guys in my next one.